In order to make sheet cam <coughs> function and be able to cut files in the plasma cutter, you need to do a few simple preparations. First thing you're going to do is come up to the options and you're going to select machine. Under machine, we're going to go to the table display and we're going to set the size. The size of our machine has an X width of 60 inches and a Y width or length of 120. We're going to do the same for our working envelope. It's going to be 60 and 120. After that, we need to adjust the post processor. So we're going to do a few things here. You're going to want to make sure that your output file units are inch. You want to make sure that your output file extension says NGC. So if yours says TAP, click in this box and type in NGC. The next thing we're going to want to do is we're going to want to import a post processor. <clears throat> you should have downloaded the post processor file from Canvas. So click on import post, go to your downloads folder, and you're going to be looking for the CNC Plasma LLCNC revision and whatever number this is that you've downloaded. <clears throat> Go ahead and open, and that will install this post processor. Now, that is all we need for this, and we're gonna hit OK. The next thing we're gonna do is we're gonna come over to our file menu. We're gonna load the tool set so that we can tell the machine what tool we're gonna be using to cut. So we're gonna come over here to open tool set. And again, it's going to give you this dialog box. You're going to go to your downloads folder and you should see the LCNC Hypertherm 45 through 105 tools. You're going to open this file and that will open the tool set that you will need for your Hypertherm. Now, the last thing we're going to do is we're going to install the license. So you're going to come up to the help window and you're going to go to install license file. In this case, you're going to come back to your downloads folder one more time. And in there, you're going to see the Sitka High School license that you have downloaded from Canvas. You're going to hit open. And after you've opened that, your sheet cam will be ready to begin post-processing and create a file that's ready for cutting on the CNC Plasma Cutter.